All right, I'm going to show you how to make a B indicator in your DAO. So first thing you want to do is download my dupe NMTs add-on from GitLab. Go to code, download these up. Open your project. Open the zip and extract the add-ons folder to your project. And then you can copy your song in there too. Back to DAO. Go to project, project settings. Plugins and enable the plugin. Now we can set up our scene. So add an animation player, an audio stream player for our song, and then a node that you want to animate to sync to the beat. So for this example, it's going to be a CSG box. All right, we'll go to the animation player, create a new animation, add a track of audio playback, select the audio stream player, and OK. Now just add your song in there. All right, now go to the CSG box and I'm going to animate the material color. So create a key for white. Okay. And black. And let's increase the animation length. And now we need to align our first node with the beat. So I want to align that around here. So let's change the snap. Zoom in. and align our node. And you can have as many nodes as you want to change the value. And it doesn't matter where they are placed because they will be rearranged automatically. And you can also change it from continuous to discrete if you want it to change instantly. Now go to the animation player. Dupe NMTs. And now we need the animation name, track path, track type, and the time between keys. So the animation name is just animation. The track path is this. So we can just click this and copy that. Go back, paste that in. For this example, the track type is just property. But if you're changing something else, you set it to one of these. And the time between keys, we need to figure out by figuring out the BPM of this song. So how I'm going to do that is I'm going to play the song and then use a website to tap to the beat. about 128. So now we can do 60 seconds divided by 128 is 0.46875. So we can copy that, go back to dupe NMTs, paste that in, and then dupe keys. And now I created nodes all the way to the end of the animation, and they should all be synced to the beat. So let's check.
All right, so it looked pretty good. So that's it. Thanks for watching.